Hello, welcome. In this tutorial, I will tell you analysis of the triplet NMR peaks. How to calculate the J value and shift value of the triplet peaks. So, how the triplet is arises? The number of proton and shift of the peak. Which type of the proton is possible? We look. For example, the ethyl bromide. The pattern and shift must be analyzed. 1.1, 1 1.22 is here, and number of proton also from integration area, and quartet is 3.29 is here. So this type of the compound is showing the triplet and quartet. Here triplet because of n plus one rule. Here is the CH2 proton, two proton. Here is the three proton. And this proton split it by 3 proton n plus 1, 3 plus 1 equal to 4. So the here is 3.29 is quartlet. So we report like 1.22 triplet j is equal to 6.9. I will show you how it come 1.22 and j 6.0 in next slides. So the other possible triplet from compound like this type of E environment proton is also having a triplet this proton also triplet this already discussed triplet so this type of the proton also triplet and this is also triplet here is doublet and here doublet because of this proton we not consider the coupling from this proton here this proton here triplet because one here one here we n plus one rule apply here is so triplet is observed so this is a symmetrical triplet c is compound showing a triplet sometime you confuse with doublet of doublet which have same chemical shift so it, it's confusing we check the uh, extensively which is a doublet of doublet, which is a triplet of triplet. The intensity of the triplet is 1 point is 2 is to 1. So here is the ideal peak of triplet. The J value is the spacing between this any two peaks is equal to J value. You can calculate any of two peaks difference and multiply it by spectrometer frequencies. So here is the calculation. You can calculate here 2.73 is the center peaks. Very easy. This type of symmetrical triplet. Um, no any destruction in triplet. The J value any two you can take this two minus this to minus this into spectrometer meter frequency or you can use difference between here and there equal to and same so difference of any two peaks represent the j values so the chemical shift is the center peak so the 1.7 triplet j is equal to 7 we are i here is you can add your compound information what type of proton how many type of proton two or three which type of proton och3 so already I said don't confuse with the doublet of doublet check the integral values some and assignments of proton num it depend upon the compound to compound sometime double of, of doublet equal j value also look like triplet in next tutorial or coming tutorial I will show you how they create confusion to the observer doublet of doublet and triplet so take care about these things doublet of doublet and triplet so non-symmetrical triplet like this one is very very confusing so the have triplet to this center of peak this and if you take outside the peak like this one or this one divided by two and we report like this or similarly if you calculate j value of this type of peaks is different come from 
here minus 1 to 2 minus and 2 to 3 minus is different so we report the average j value and other ways also calculation doing like this j value so we report the j value 6.9 to and chemical shift like this averaging the chemical shift or you can say average of the chemical shift uh, something like this so it's very complicated triplet uh, not complicated but unsymmetrical not easily phasing problem in an, actually this is a type of phasing problem in NMR spectroscopy so this type of the peak is arise uh, phasing problem or you can say compound characteristics problems of the NMR so report like this NMR spectroscopy if you have not a sharp triplet in your uh, NMR uh, report or uh, NMR spectrums so please like and subscribe my channel for coming doublet of doublet doublet, doublet and triplet of doublet doublet of triplet how to calculate chemical shift and j value of these compounds please like and subscribe my channel thank you